Limey Kennel, Shenicky, November 1st. This is our third session today. We messed the other two up bad. Gonna let it get a little intensity. Drag, 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 drag. Go! That's it, mama. See, she's digging in there real good. She's getting her style. She's getting her track. Widening that track, digging it a little deeper. Eventually, we'll be adding straw little by little to build slowly build berm walls with straw and natural clay that we have here in this state. Uh, again, we're not conditioning this dog, we're just having fun and burning off the energy that everybody with dogs like this needs to do. You want these high drive dogs? People complain they're a pain in the ass, this, that, the other thing. A lot of these guys are the guys that don't do shit with their dogs. They just pull chains all day. And ain't nothing wrong with being on a chain or pulling a chain. It's, it has its own merit as far as uh, conditioning of the dog even. Good girl. But uh, I don't know, man. I wouldn't just flip my camera off out here for you guys, all five viewers that I got, uh, just to show you two dogs walking a chain, man. Get them out here doing something. Uh, start making, start normalizing people using treadmills and, and, and jennies, you know. We don't want to call this a cat mill. It's not a cat mill. There's no cat. There's no cage. That right there is a deer park bottle. I don't know if you noticed. Or you uh, concerned citizens. Come on, mama. And that's an ALM uh, little bite pillow right there. They're like the tiny little cute keychain one they make. Uh... That's it, man. You know, we're going to get some more different dogs out here, too, of different breeds, just to try to put a, a, a better light and to, again, to normalize people conditioning these dogs, man. Come on, mama. You know, you see these all these dogs wind up going into bad uh, places because they're too much trouble for the person or, you know, you don't know what you're getting rid of if you get rid of a dog that people complain, oh, it's a hard keep, it's a hard keep. A lot of you people are just lazy, man. Just fucking lazy. But yeah, man, Limey Kennel Shenicky. Come on, mama. She's a great little girl. Thanks to Ir uh, Irma, I, I forget how to say her name, uh, to Big D. Big D sent me some amazing genetic material. Come on, mama. Come on. See, she likes to stop and stalk it every once in a while. She thinks that uh, it's going to pull back if she... She knows it pulls back when she when she stops and goes. So I'm trying to develop her style a little more. I don't want her doing that so much. Come on, mama. But back to uh, Limey Kennels, Big D. Thank him so much, man. He sent us an amazing little animal. Such great genetics, everything. The, the, the confirmation on this dog is perfect. Come on, mama. She, she's uh, surpassed all my expectations already. Not to mention what we got in the bank, providing that this dog works out and she hunts good, man. We're going to get her out there uh, in the woods of Virginia, and you know, as soon as, the, uh, as, soon as uh, deer and turkey season's over. Come on, mama. We'll get her out there and try to get her on some real rough Eurasians. Come on, mama. Come on. See, she's doing that stalk thing. She sits there and she stalks it. She's not, see, she's not really tired. She's not panting, see? But she's gonna learn. Cause that's why that's why I should be having the weights on right now to teach her more. Uh, she'll have to learn that every time she's the machine, she's the momentum. Every time she stops, she has to cr create new momentum and use more strength just to get the, the rotation going. So again, this is a young animal, just turned a year old, and uh, we're really happy with her so far, man. Very, I, I couldn't be more happy with this dog. All right, guys, I'm going to shut it down right now. Thanks to my five subscribers. Limey Kennel Shenicky. Great little dog working the Scorpion Jenny by Dog Trotter. All right, have a good day.